Hello everyone, uh, welcome to the new year. It feels like the new start is finally happening with this first painting video. Thanks for watching the previous video uh, about the studio. Um, got a lot of nice feedback from that. And it feels good to be out of the hoodie now sometimes, even though I'm in the hoodie for this one. <laughs> we were still transitioning between uh, hoodie or not at this point, so don't get to see the hair on this one. This video is all about um, the decision I made to paint over this painting, Calm Water. Um, it's a huge canvas and it was completed over a year ago and I liked the painting and it did have a lot of good comments but it was painted at quite a turbulent time in my life and when I put it back up on the wall after exhibiting it at Norwich it didn't feel right to me to keep looking at it because it reminded me of the time that I painted it so I took the decision to do a repaint and not only did this um, help with not looking at it anymore um, but it also I think boosts your energy into painting again. This was, I started this on New Year's Eve actually and um, I think that it just helped me to get back into painting after having some time off at Christmas and doing the exhibition. And I hadn't painted for a little while, even though I'd got a painting half started on the easel. It takes courage to do this, and there is a slight pause at the beginning of the clip of, of me starting this, where I just hesitated for a moment, thinking, is this what I want to do? I don't know. Um, and then I just went for it, and then by the time I, I got into it, you can see I'm just squirting the paint onto the canvas and, and brushing it in. And it does feel very energising, in a way. Kind of getting my mojo back here, this is what I thought. I'm using acrylic paint to go over the original initially, um, and just layering that on pretty thick. Uh, it's a very solid white acrylic, so it's covering the, the painting quite nicely underneath. And I'm gonna go all over that with the acrylic. Um, and spread it out as evenly as I can. And then after that was dry, I went back over the whole canvas again with a layer of thinned down white oil paint because I was gonna be painting back over it in oil. Um, but because I wanted to cover up what was underneath, I needed a good couple of layers of color. And being the cheapskate that I am, I thought I'd use acrylic to hide the colour and then put a base layer of oil over the top of that. Um, and I was going to try doing uh, oil on oil, wet on wet um, oil painting. Um, and so I was going to leave the, the oil layer uh, wet and work straight into it to do uh, a nice big cloud painting. That was my intention. Um, what I didn't anticipate was how long the first layer would take to dry. So after this acrylic layer dried pretty quick, I went straight over it with the, the oil and I didn't thin down that, that oil layer in anywhere near enough. So it remained extremely wet. And when I started to put on colour, um, it just completely thinned it down. There was no intensity in the colour at all. Um, and uh, you'll see in a minute I'm going to start putting on, uh, on the colour. And it, it really didn't look like anything at all. <laughs> and by that point I thought, what on earth have I done? Um, I'm still working on the painting now and it's still not dry, believe it or not, even after a couple of weeks. Um, so. Clearly that didn't work out very well, but I still don't mind that um, like that happened because painting for me is just about um, discovering things and learning and making mistakes. And obviously next time I'll know to do it completely different. Um, that's what life is about, that's what painting is about for me. Um, so here I'm putting on a layer of colour that I've mixed up and it's just disappearing into that wet uh, layer of oil paint. Um, I'm about 
three stages on from this at the moment and as I say it's still not dry but uh, I'll persevere with it and hopefully it'll end up being a, a nice cloud painting eventually. Um, it's got a lot of hope to it I think this painting and because of the, the repaint, the restart, it feels like it's energised with a, a new um, impulse, a new energy and I'm really enjoying just looking at it when I walk past it um, in progress. Uh, anyway, um, I hope you've enjoyed watching this crazy little video um, and I hope that uh, maybe you'll attempt to paint over yourself. Um, be energised, be inspired and, and be bold and go for it because I think it's uh, really thrilling <laughs> to do that. Um, and the painting underneath is, you know, it's still there, it's still part of it. For me that, that enhances it as well. Anyway, happy painting everyone and uh, take care. Come back and see how it turns out.